Okay, this one is an interesting one. Let's see if we can make it look good. It's a torn piece of paper I found on the ground. I actually tore part of it off to use for another demo later on, but the image is really nice. <laughs> Seems tragic that it's torn, but we're going to make something nice out of it. I don't know how big this one's going to be. It's quite a small piece. I don't know how big we're going to make it. So we're going to try and get intuitive. I normally wait until I've got the image on the glass, but for some reason I'm just doing this. So I wonder how big we're going to make this part. So we're going to make it 370. Okay. Right. Fair amount of contrast. I'm going to lighten that up. I'm going to make this into something interesting. I'm going to leave the black on in the middle. Okay, what have we got? Okay, let's see what it is. What have we got? We got here. It's out of a travel. I think it'd be a travel pamphlet. It was actually um, to do with Virgin, Virgin USA. But I took off, tore off the the Virgin bit. And we're going to use that in another demo somewhere down the track. So let's see if we can make this into a nice mirror image, a nice four way mirror image. So we're just going to put that edge against there. Let's see if we can make it look really nice, even though it's just a piece of tattered old paper, or should I, or heavy paper. Someone, it looked like someone just tore it up, but I only just saw that, that part, and the part that was, that I tore out, which had Virgin USA written on it, if I remember correctly. So let's see if we've made this one look good. Oh, I think we've made it too big on the uh, vertical and too short on the horizontal but that looks interesting you can even see the printers dots so yeah you can see the printers dots but anyway let's just get get this going let's just change our settings around so we're going to take the um, the X and we're going to make it bigger so I'm wondering if we're going to make it 340 going to make it 345. Actually, I don't think that's big enough. Fuck it. It's not big enough. 345 can't be big enough. going to make it 350. And the vertical is going to be 300 and not 370. We've already done that. It's too high. So we're going to make it 340, we're going with 340, which was what we had there. So let's see how this goes. This is just our make ready process at the moment. Printers understand what make ready means. Let's see how this goes. Okay, let's see if we've made this better. Yeah, that's a lot better, but we st even with the 10%, we're still too close to the edge. And this, I think we can do, we can have a bit more of that island. We want that island to show because it's only a small feature compared with the um, rest of it. So, I'm trying to think, what else would I do? I'm just trying to see something, guys and girls. I just forgot something. Which side's the island on? The island is on the bottom. So it's going to be a nuisance be trying to make this island into something, a feature. But we will. Maybe when I make the master copy, we're going to make it better. So we just put that back where it was. Okay, so 350 is still not big enough. So we're going to just kick it off. We're going to make it 300 and 60 for that and for this 
320. We're going to go and up the ante and we're going to hit 320 instead of 340. Let's see how this goes. Okay. We're not moving this original. This original is going to be a still. We're going to put make together a mirror image based on that beautiful, featuring that beautiful island. So we're going to make the island like the feature of this. So that looks quite nice. We can still see a bit of the rip. So maybe we make it bigger and that'll be good if it's a bit, if it's a lot bigger. So we're just going to go back and we're going to, oh, it's just itching, sorry folks. So we're going to make the X a lot larger. So we're going to go here. And the X is going to be 300. We're going to make it 380. And the Y is going to be... We're going to make 300. So I really made a bad job at guesstimating this. We've had to just tweak and tweak and tweak. So let's see if we've tweaked this nicely. Out it comes. Let's see how we go. That looks a lot better. So that's a lot better. So we can. I'm wondering if we're gonna. We're gonna go any further? Maybe not. I think we're ready to create our mirror image. Or maybe we can go one more. We can make it a bit smaller than that. So we're gonna make the. We're gonna make the horizontal. Uh, 380 or we're going to make pull up pull out the stops and give it 400 percent and the vertical is going to be 290 so they're going to be a little a lot of distortion here so let's see if we've made this extra better let's see if we've made this island dream look really nice <laughs> Okay, this is going to be a prolongated demo. It's going to go for a long time by the looks of things. We're only just get, starting to get things organised and that looks a lot better. I think the 400 is, is, all, is as much as we can get. So, wondering what we're going to do with this. We're going to vertically enlarge it and I think this is going to be our special corner. It's hard to tell. This is a fucking difficult demo so i'm wondering if we're just gonna take it off the glass we don't want all that tatty stuff making it look a bit yucky so i think we're we've blown that off the page so wondering now we're just going to throw this away this is going in the recycle where all our card our paper and cardboard bits do and we're just going to take this and make this our master copy so, oops, sorry folks, I should have pulled the dock feeder up before grabbing the master. So we're just going to quick play with the machine so we don't lose our settings and we set up for copied paper. And this is going to be the edge at the top. So we're going to go up here. I'm just going to somehow put it on the glass nicely. So this is how it's going up. It's going up that way. So we're just going to put it upside down like that. And... One thing to note is that if I enlarge, it's going to leave an, a gap. So I've got to push the original. We've got to put this over the lip on the edge of the glass so we don't get big borders when we're enlarging because we're going to have to enlarge. We're still enlarging, so we just have to put our paper just like something like that, just over the edge so we don't have the heavy thick borders thick borders will make a mirror image look like shit so now we're just going to go back here and the vertical so the horizontal is just going to be 104 and the vertical is going to be large so we're going to make the vertical so 290 for the vertical so going that way and we just have to set up other things while we're still at it. Stupid user interface. I just pushed it along when I didn't want to. So we're going to up the contrast almost full, but not all the way. 
copy density. Going to darken it, make it more rich, and the water will hopefully look more emeraldy. And maybe we're going to add some black to make it look even nicer. So, okay, so here we go. Let's just give it a go. Let's see, here we go. We're a long way into this demo. We're over a hundred. We're over ten minutes and thirty seconds. Way over. But hey, it's hopefully going to be worth it. Stabilizing image. Please wait. Typical comic of an altar. So it's a big. Let's see how this goes. Oh shit, it looks nice, the water looks green, but we've made it too big. It still looks like it could make a good mirror image, but we made it too big on the vertical. So we're going to, we're just going to put that aside. So we're fucked up, we're just fucking up all the way with the enlargements. We're not doing our enlargements easily anymore. Now I'm just checking to see if there's any border, I think it's okay. So we're now just going to take down from 290 290 is way 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 too big way 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 so we're going to make it 180 we're taking it right down to 180 it was overkill so this is going to be a really prolongated demo so hope you guys are hope most of you guys viewing this are actually photocopier enthusiasts or toner heads for you to appreciate this convoluted process that I'm going through at this stage now that looks really nice so I'm wondering if we're going to make trying to work out which is going to be the center I think that's going to be the center so now we're just gonna it looks nice you can still see printers dots galore so we're just going to take this wonder if we're going to make it bigger or we're just going to use this and we're just going to hit off another this demo is going to take a long time to upload to YouTube and Facebook. Well, I'm going. I normally do my Facebook versions in a lower res, so I'll see what we do. I think this will just be a YouTube demo. I don't do everything with Facebook, but I do. And anyway, this is fucking on the curliness again. At least it's not curling in the middle for a change. So for some reason it's curling, it's too much, you know, it ink, the toner it gets thick, but it shouldn't be curling like that. Let's see what we're going to got. Let's see, we're going to make two mirror images. Switch that on. Hey, did I just switch it on? I didn't. I have to, you have to hit the on button like that and then press OK. So now we're just going to hit off. Oh, I should have made it two, not one. So I'm just going to hit the stop key. So we just stop the job and we're just going to add two to make it a bit quicker so this demo doesn't become too prolongated. I'm going to be going through more micro SD cards if I keep this up. <laughs> okay, that's one. And that's two. So that's the two mirrors. So these are our mirrored versions of the same job. So we're just going to put them together if we can avoid having too much trouble due to the curling of the paper, which is a real total nuisance, but we can't stop. For some reason we just can't seem to have any control over it. Even when I try to take precautions like putting damp red in the bedside table where the paper is stored, I still seem to be getting problems. Maybe I bought a dud ream from office works don't, don't get me wrong office works is okay it's, i'll get a lot of good things from them but anything could happen you know the paper could be off you know maybe it, you can't probably you can't blame it on office works but who knows but this looks apart from this damn curliness this looks really nice 